In this video, I am going to solve the question number uh, 5C of model question paper uh, 2. So, in a city A, 20% of a random sample of 900 school boys had a certain slight physical defect in another city B, 18.5% of a random sample of 1600 school boys had the same defect had the same defect if the difference between the proportions significant at 5% level of significance. So we need to solve this problem as they have given uh, samples of two proportions. We need to solve the difference of samples of uh, those proportions is significant at 5% level of uh, level or not. So identify what is given the sample size has been given as 900 and uh, 1600 I have note down that as n1 and n2 uh, the sample proportion has been given p1 as 20 percent that is 20 by 100 will be equal to 0.2 p2 is 18.5 uh, percent so 18.5 divided by 100 which becomes 0.185 then I am going to define null hypothesis as follows. The null hypothesis is nothing but there is no significant difference of physical defect. So for that reason, I will define P1 is equal to P2. So alternative hypothesis H1 will be defined as there is significant different as H0 is no significant difference. We need to define uh, alternative significant alternative hypothesis as significant there is significant difference of physical defect as p1 is not equal to p2 then i am going to find out uh, the capital p uh, sample proportion p is given by n1 p1 plus n2 p2 divided by n1 plus n2 this will be given in your uh, handbook this formula will be given in your handbook you can go through and refer that uh, formula and incorporate this and substitute all the values n1 p1 n2 p2 values and simplifying that we are going to get the value of p and after getting the value of p i can find out the value of q so i am going to get the value of q as 0.81 after getting p and q i am going to find out standard error standard error is given by the formula square root of P Q, whatever the value I find out P and Q, P Q times of 1 over N1 plus 1 by N2. So, substituting all those values, I am going to get the standard error values 0 0.0163. Then, I will be substituting in normal variant that is Z is equal to P1 minus P2 divided by square root of P Q times of 1 by N1 plus 1 by N2. Substituting all these values, I am going to get the value as 0 0.92. I am checking for two-tailed uh, two test and just I am showing in terms of two-tailed test uh, for the given problem. So, for 5% level of significance, the value is 1.96, so which is less than 1.96. For 1% level also, it is less than uh, the value 2.58. This is the critical value for 1% so for both it is less than thus we can say that null hypothesis is accepted at both 5% and 1% level of significance as the given question is only 1 5% you can define for 5% alone so this is how we can solve this problem